How you doing guys? I'm Sean. Welcome to Rambles with my camera. Guys, today's video, today's Ramble, it's day 16 of my 30 day video and photography challenge. So listen guys, I'm going to keep this pretty quick. I say Saturday afternoons about 10 to 5 and uh, I never got out to take any photographs today. I was doing a wee bit of uh, editing and I've also I've had a problem there with the bike now. Obviously, the bike, the problem yesterday, that you've, the video you've seen there that the key stuck on it, that was all rectified. But basically I had a bit of a problem with the gears at the back since I had that fall um, two weeks ago and then also the rope, the bungee cord wrapping around the gears at the back and the back wheel. And so I'm going to get the, the bike serviced. So I try to change it. Are there any wee noises in the background here? This is wee Mog. Probably have no camera on the go here but Mog's chasing his wee uh, toy in the ground. So if you hear any noises that's what it's all about. So listen, what I was going to do is um, I'm just going to have a quick talk here. See this photograph you have in front of you? Um, obviously that was from yesterday's video, Friday's video, in the market. Now I always get asked about when you're photographing kids and things like that, do you have to ask permission? Well, depending on what country you're living in, um, the copyright laws is completely different. Um, I rarely ask um, because basically I think it spoils the moment. And you've seen in the video clip that, you know, I've seen the kids sitting pointing, it could be as I'm assuming it's his daddy and they're picking a toy out. So I took that shot. Now, worst case scenario, the daddy would have looked around and said, what are you doing taking my photograph of the kid? I did a video before where I talk about have a business card handy. Know your story. Why are you taking photographs of the kids in the first place? Why are you taking photographs of people in the first place? Once you know that, then tell them. And, you know, all people really want to know is, is who you are, what you're doing. And that's usually suffice. It's usually very rarely you ever get any hassle. I think in the whole... 30 odd years I've been taking photographs. There's only two run-ins, I think. Uh, one recently there with a head case, but basically two in the whole of 30 years photographing, you know, thousands of people. So tell them what you're doing, take a photograph, but I think this captures why candid photography, you know, most cases is better uh, than the post. Do you know what I mean? Because you've got, this is the moment that the wee kid is just looking, pointing his daddy, and I think his daddy asked him a couple of times which one he wants, he's picked it. I don't know which one he has picked, by the way. I never hung around to see, but I am hope he's enjoying it. So, guys, listen, I'm going to wrap this up. Have a fantastic rest of the weekend. You're going to see us on Sunday. Um, I'm going to be heading out tonight with Sheena. I'm meeting her friends. We're going to go for a bit of a meal. So I'm going to make us pretty, pretty quick. Uh, know that I'm sending you love from Belfast. And thanks again for all your comments and love and support you've been giving to the channel. Much appreciated. And as I say, have a fantastic day and the rest of the weekend. And I'll catch you guys in the next video.